<laughs> oh my god, okay, there we go. That's, uh, that's the new creature that's in the game. The Titana Boa. As of this second, I am playing the game as it's just been updated. Um, and in it is the, uh, the new Titana Boa. So if we go into Dinosaurs, and we scroll down, there should be new ones there. Oh, wow, there's like, woo, there's quite a few. So what are the new dinosaurs or creatures, I should say? Because there's a lot of just general creatures here um, that are dinosaurs. So the new one is this, the Titana, or the Dilophoboa. So there's a Titana bow in the game. There's a Dilophoboa. And if, I think one of these is the next level up. That is the, um, it's like, Dilophos con constrictor or something like that. There's also this guy, which is new. Um, oh, he's just an epic. Mayagira and Megaloceros, I think that is. Oh, that's interesting. This is, a ooh, this is a new one. The spin constrictor. Oh, maybe it's this one. Oh, no, no, this is it. This is the, sp the spino constrictor. So you need Spinosaurus. Finally, something to use all that Spinosaur DNA. And welcome, sorry, did I not do the intro to Jurassic World Alive? I just got taken aback by that uh, splash screen there. And I didn't even expect to be recording again today. I've already recorded two videos over an hour long each and um, my voice is kind of gone. So uh, excuse me <laughs> if I sound, sound kind of dead. Uh, it's also Dilophosaur Gen 2, so that's good. You're going to need a lot of Gen 2. Uh, there's also this thing, which is the Entelodon and the Mammoth. Oh, Entelomoth. Ooh, interesting, interesting. Okay, so right off the bat, I can't see in the incubators how to get the Titanoboa. So maybe it's only the wild, maybe it's only event at this stage. I don't know, but I do know, however, that we have a legendary incubator open, which even I got this before the, uh, the update. So I don't know, maybe there's a chance we can get it in this. Also, um, yeah, maybe I'll put in the footage somewhere now of me catching the Ardennes Maxima. Hello everyone, welcome to the car. Because, for good reason, you can probably see it like right there, I think. There we go, stay there, don't move. We are catching or darting the one and only, we've got 90 minutes left to do it, the Ardentis Maxima. This thing, oh my God, I've been using it and I've put like a crud ton of uh, resources into it. So a basically a lot of health, because that's what it has going for it. Um, and we've had some good things come in the past. We've had Indoraptor not too long ago, at least since recording this. And uh, I've never darted this thing before. I wanted to get as close as I could, because every second counts. Um, and because it's a sauropod and a brachiosaur, I'm assuming that it's gonna be really hard. Now, I don't know how to do the glitch where you get multiple tries, because I've done that in the past. And then it just goes, yeah, no, you're not allowed to do it. <laughs> it's like, oh, you got nothing at the end of, or at least when I've tried anyway, things have just disappeared. Um, there's no way to check a history of darts. So, fingers crossed, here we go. Because I only need 80 to level it. I'd like more, but, okay, I'm doing my, iPod, my iPhone, so I should be good at this. There you go, one. Oh, got the head. Two, oh, that's not, oh, oh yeah, okay, 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 come on, concentrate, James, a little bit ahead of it. A little bit ahead. Oh no. That's a 10. That's not a direct hit. Oh, this is not going good. I mean, it's... Oh, it could be a lot better. Oh, the foot! Oh no! The worst! Come on, one more. That's 106! <laughs> oh my god! Well, you know what? I only needed 80. We can get to level 26. I'm happy with that. I'm also gonna take a screenshot. I'm actually shaking. <laughs> I was that nervous. I need it. Oh my god. Well, you know, 106, it's not bad. Uh, we'll just pick up that while we're here. Why not? Get an extra 600 coins. So, uh, I mean, that's my team at the moment. It hasn't much changed in months. I've added Gryposuchus because if you can get Gryposuchus' health up a lot, you can switch in like retaliate hit regenerate half your health and then switch out again you, you need uh, you need like a, to be against good opponents or at least a good opponent for your set how much health does it get <gasps> almost seven thousand oh 
and then if I just get a little bit more health perks or health mods or whatever you want to call them. But yeah, let's go back and uh, level up dinos and just see what we can do. Did I put it in? Well, there you go. That was me catching the Ardennes Max. We went in the car for a second. That's amazing. This is the power of editing. So we got to make it all with 2,466 units. Been saving that for this video. Uh, what we got? Who? Bionics and the other one being... Uh, not really worth it, if I've got to be honest. Oh, are you going to make a video about this update? No! E-Monster, I'm never... Of course I'm not going to make a video about it. <laughs> okay. Right, so another new thing that's never happened before. I have 1,050,000 coin. Never had a million coin before. I, that just shows like from the last episode to this one, I've played it that much, or at least it's been that long that I've managed to save up a million coin. Tells you something. So, I don't know what it tells you. You can, you can make that yourself. But we have, oh yeah, that's what I was going to say about these uh, mods. I fought the other day. Um, Ehrlichosaurus, it was only level 28, um, or Ehrlichomimus, and it had maxed uh, attack stats. It was ludicrous, and one hit it did 2,400, and that was only level 28, so two more levels, it killed my Thorder in one hit, which is uh, pretty sad. But the way this game's going now with mods, it feels as though every day there's just, you can buy mods. Oh, sorry, not mods, uh, uh, boosts, that's it. Which kind of defeats the point in my eyes because there's a lot of people who cheat. There's a lot of people who don't get caught for it. There's a lot of glitches that people can expose. And there's a lot of pay to win. So it makes sense if the, the, the mods, or sorry, the boosts only come out, you know, when people can afford them or maybe they can afford two or maybe they can afford just one, but at least that they can afford them. But they're out all the time. So if there are pay to win players out there, they just boost them all. Which is what happened with me and I got killed by an Earl of Demimus or whatever it was called with one hit of my Thordor. And it was my Thordor was level 30 and it got killed in one hit. It was ridiculous. Anyway, so Ardennes Maxima have been uh, leveling up, mainly just health. And um, as far as yeah, this event, we managed to get some extra ones. So that's 100,000, which is pocket change. We've got a million. So adding the health, adding the attack. And we should be able to fuse it a couple more times. I think I need to do this one. So let's do a multi-fusion. Multi-fusion! Actually, I can't. I can only do two fives. Actually, I can't even do uh, two fives. I can do that one. So there's two pops. Um, and I'm just not going to be able to do the five. So we're going to have to do four individuals then. Would you believe? There's 30. That's already a third of what I just got. So we got three left. So we've got a guarantee of getting, you know, three pops at the Ard Ardennes Maxima. Oh, there you go. So there's three pops. We could even, this could be 100. It could be 50. So we've got two more of these to do. Oh, Secadonosaurus. What did I use Secadonosaurus for? Another 30. Oh, come on. Let's get a 20. Last one. Is it last one? Yeah, last one. Okay, come on. Get the 20. Don't get it. Get a 20. Get it. Or 100. That'd be amazing. 20 is good. Okay, so four pops at the Ardennes Maxima. I'm assuming we're not going to level it up, but it's worth a try. I mean, we've got to try. So that's four. So we won't be able to do the five because we're just missing that. So we're going to have to do them individually. Ah, uh, and I don't know how many I feel- Ooh, 30 is good! Oh, yes! Give me 100. Oh! I can only do three more, so I could technically have this maxed up to level 27 if I got 300. Chances of that is one in a billion. And there you have it. Now I get the 10s. Yes. Now on the ones that I need, I'm getting the 10s. Couldn't have got the 30s before. Another 10. Another one. <laughs> and one more? Come on, don't be a 10. Don't be a 10. Come on. Be a, be a 50 or something good. I'll take it. It's better than a 10. It's double than a 10. Um, and I do want to use a mod just to get that health up to 7,000. That's that's killer. That's crazy. Uh, also, we got Magnetator as well. Um, so I've got... I've, I've, oh, I don't have five for the Dimetrodon DNA either. Damn. Close. Close. So we'll just have to go individual for this one. Uh, also, I just want to say, oh, 40, yes, that's good. That's more lucky. I want to say thank you to the people in my alliance who have recently donated uh, Irritated DNA to me. Um, I always feel, oh, 70, yes. Oh, my God. Woohoo. That's good. That's good. Let's keep it going. Let's keep it going. Get another, get a, that's rare. Getting a 70 is rare. So we got, we got a lot. Uh, we've got one more pop for this. And I think I should have, oh, no, I don't even have it. Well, there you go. 
There you go, that's pretty decent, because then we've just got two more levels on that thing, 29 and 30, and we're done. Um, Gripo, I'm close. I'm close to Gripo. Should we have a look to see if anybody's managed to find this and put it in an incubator, the uh, Titanoboa? Oh! What's this? So this is it? Is this the actual Titanoboa? What is this? How have people found it already? I guess it's just through sanctuaries, isn't it? Uh, this is Titanoboa Gen 2. Oh, look at it. Oh, that's cool. Okay. Now, I'm really interested in this to see its killing animation. And everyone was hyped when we saw this. People were like, this is a Jurassic Park builder. It's Jurassic World. Put in Mosasaur. We don't need a Titanoboa. I just love that Lydia is so like... They're, they're entrenched in their own, like, oh, we gotta do this way, this way, this way. So we release the aquatics, then the glaciers, then we put Titan a bone. People are like, friggin', where's the Mosasaur first? Where's the aquatic? <laughs> or like other dinosaurs that were in the movie. But anyway, let's have a look at this probably disgust. Oh no, the poor goat. No, the goat! Oh no! Well then. Well then. Yes, I can, I'm, I'm safe from copper, definitely. So how do you play with a snake? Is it gonna go through it? He's just gonna bite it. Bah. Oh, that's cool. I love it. The animations are so cool. Uh, so that's that one. Let's see if we can get our own. How many do we need? Oh, we only need a couple. Oh, it's so sad on the goat. But I want it. I've got to kill so many goats because I want it. And then we can put it in the sanctuary, actually. I don't know if I can. I think I've probably already uh, put all mine in. So there's a 12. Thank God I've got lots of food and uh, things on the go. And we'll do it again. I think that should be it. There you go. We got it. We got one of the newest thanks to the sanctuaries. An amazing uh, bit that Ludia put in. They didn't really have to, but they wanted, you know, I thought they would just go with gyms like with Pokemon uh, Go, but they didn't. They decided to do something different. Still yet to see um, the main one, I think. So if we go here and we can scroll down, maybe it's that one, actually. Maybe that's what you need. So let's go all the way down. And unlock it! I still haven't done the deer. Nobody puts the deer in, <laughs> so I don't have the deer. <laughs> okay, Titanoboa Gen 2. So I'm assuming Titanoboa is an epic. But does this have any hybrids? This this guy. Uh, maybe? No. No, this guy doesn't. But it has precise rampage, precise impact, immune to destruction, and this is new to the Titanoboa family. When opponent leaves, gain 50% damage, two turns, and become invincible for one turn. So, oh God, if, if somebody just switches out, so Rampage and Run, or just generally switching out for Dracoceratops. So the new Titanoboa, me, the Dracoceratops is gone. And actually there, there's a meme, um, somebody posted a picture of the new uh, week coming and it has Dracoceratops on the Sunday and everyone's like, five years too late. <laughs> oh, that's great. Mmm, the lack of pigment makes it a corn snake, kind of. Oh, lovely! Look at him bite the camera. Fantastic. Okay. Well, let's open up this incubator and see what we can get here. Probably nothing of interest. Maybe, yep. Oh, some interactions and undersuited, which we've already maxed out. Fantastic. So what we're going to do, because I have an epic scent, and what comes from epic scents is kind of random. In fact, last night I put one off and I just was in bed, so I didn't move much. <laughs> obviously. Uh, so I just got one dinosaur every time. And I got a T-Rex, a Brachiosaurus, a Cynoceratops, um, another T-Rex, and that was just from one incubator. So if it is something that's only incubator or possibly something like this, maybe we have a chance of encountering a Titanoboa. So let's put it out. I think the first one's always an epic. Ah, Concavenator. Okay. Okay. Well then. Well then. Concavenator, not bad. Um... Do I not get to see? Do I not get to see? Oh, okay, there we go. Oh, interesting. So you've got to hold it. Oh, this is new. They've added a, like a reticle to the middle. So you can see exactly where it's going. Ooh, that's good, actually. Oh, God. This thing's so blooming big that usually... Oh, it's so weird. Now, con concave it is not the hard one to do. So the fact that I'm not getting loads of direct hits all the time, even though I, I got a fair few there. That's worrying, because if we do fight Titanobo, that thing's going to move like crazy. And on this thing, not so good. So that's the first encounter. Oh, look, 
look, we got more irritated DNA. I didn't even notice that. Oh, thank you guys. Oh, and then 100. <laughs> I forgot to collect that. Oh, that's it. That means we get one more pop at uh, Magnetator. We've had some good luck with Magnetator, so let's see. I'm happy. I'll take that 10 here for 100 on the actual Magnetator. So will we get it? One pop. Come on. Oh, we're getting lucky. 30 is pretty decent. Oh, that's good. We're going to get you to level 29. I need to increase your speed, though. Magnetate, if you get its speed up. Oh, it's so good. You know what? How much speed do I have? 107, so I've just got enough. I'm going to put a speed up. 144 speed. Okay, what do we get? What do we get? Oh, Giraffe Titan. Not bad, not bad. <laughs> 206. You know what? It's good practice because if we do come across, at least I'm like getting used to this thing again. You know what? We'll do one of these. We'll open up an incubator while we're here because otherwise we're just waiting for ages. Right. Yeah, I, I mean, I'm, I do enjoy this game and I'm not, I'm not, I'm not really like annoyed at the boost system that they've got in at the moment. It does just feel like they're favoring pay to win players. And from a business perspective, I can see why. I can see why they would want to do that because they want to make money. And there is something that I was watching a Pokefodder video and Michael, I remember his name, because when we did that thing at Ludia, I actually forgot his name. Uh, therefore, I always remember it now. It, it always, it's like, Michael, just comes to me. And I'm terrible with names. So, But you have a traumatic experience or you, you have something like that happen. Something to, you know, a little bit of a, a story around a name. You always remember it. So, as a little top tip. Be the top tip for you. Oh, oh we got an... Oh, it's, uh, it's Demetrodon. Do I, do I even want Demetrodon? I, I don't think I want Demetrodon. No, I don't want Demetrodon. Can I, can I fight something else? But... Instead of what he told me or what I saw in that video is, you know, every time you open up a regular incubator, a three hour or whatever, um, you get a few mods or a few boosts. Sorry, I keep on saying that. You get a few boosts every time you open up an incubator and it works out cheaper to just speed up those incubators, which is about 30 bucks and getting like two or three. I think you get, you probably get two. Um, and that's, that works out cheaper to do it that way rather than buy it by the boosts outright. So if you're not after anything in particular and you just want general boosts, then it's better to just do loads of battles. Therefore, you get coin anyway. Um, oh, come on. I'm on the clock here. We need to go back and see what spawned you little buggy. <laughs> Instant distraction, of course. Uh, I don't even know. I think it's early... Erlamimus or Erlicosaurus is next, and I can probably just instant priority that, instant charge. Um, but yeah, that way is probably best if you want any mods. Or you don't, or you want like not in specific mods, because it's probably like a random choice. You probably get, I don't know, a mixture. It's probably like 30%, 30%, 30%, or 33%, 0.33%, I should say. So many people. Sorry, I'm really hot. I've got this zipped up and I've got lights blasting at us. But I can't take this off because I got a green shirt. Otherwise, I'd go invisible. So I, this is for you. <laughs> it's for me, really. <laughs> Wait, I didn't get another one, did I? Well, go on. I guess I might as well make some coin. So here we go. So you, you open up one of these. It costs you about 30 bucks. You get coin and then you get a dart and then you get two um, boosts. So let's say you open 10 of them. That's 300. That's 20 boosts. Um, and it's probably, they've probably got an offer here. Ah, like always, there you go. So 20 boosts is 300 bucks to speed up on incubators. Plus you get DNA, plus you get coin, and you get coin for battling. Uh, basically, yeah. For 450, I think you would get, or it is 300, so 600, which is only 100 more than this, would get you 40. Just to put it in perspective, it's, yeah, don't buy the bucks. Oh, sorry, don't buy the boosts. Thing is, once I've told you that, Ludia have also heard that. So do it now. If you really want boosts and you've got lots of books to burn through, do not buy them in the marketplace unless... Now, this is all right. there's two options that Ludia can go about this, right? First option is probably the one they're going to do. They're going to take them out of the incubators. That's what they're going to do. Second option is actually to make them give you more out of the marketplace. They're not going to do that. That would be too nice. <laughs> gonna take. Oh, here we go. 
What are we gonna get? I can't be mad at you because you're act I mean you're an you're an epic, but you're a useless epic. You only give me bloomin' diplovinator. And diplovinator's not very good. Oh fine, I'll dart you. Okay. You see, this guy's not too hard. I need like normal theropods, apart from the T-Rex, because the T-Rex is huge. Like this kind of theropod, a medium size, like uh, Majungasaurus is quite easy to dart. You know, if you're not a little bit off center, like I was in the last three. <laughs> Got it like the right distance, but not in the, uh, not in the right aim there. So another 255 for Concavenator, fantastic. May as well do another battle while we're here. So technically, it should take a while for anybody to get this new Titanoboa. Just because it seems to be maybe something you've just got to encounter out in the actual world. And maybe, like, there's no way to... Oh, we... is, that, is that a Brachiosaurus? That looks like a Brachiosaurus. Ah, it's a giraffe attack, damn it. <laughs> got excited there for a second. Even better, some might say. 269. Ooh, ooh, vet, what, what? What was that? Veteran drones were more sensitive? Something about that. We can get a Trichosaurus a little pop. Get a little cheeky pop. What do we get? Whoa, 30, nice. One's Trichosaurus is maxed. Ah, Trichosaurus is another one that needs health as well. Oh, oh they're taking the shadows away. That's interesting. And Gryposuchus. Ah, oh, if I got Gryposuchus, loads of health. Because 4,000, it's just, if he's level 23, it's just not enough. I have 152. You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna use it on our dentist maxima just at the moment because, like, just that seven. When if you battle something and you see seven thousand one in twenty five health, you're like, oh, 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 oh no. <laughs> oh, I, I, damn it! Another one. Why couldn't you just be- is it because I'm in the same spot? Is that it? I'm just gonna get these same dinosaurs. Probably, probably. 253. Ah, uh, you know, 250, that's really good. That's really good. That's that's at least a couple of direct hits. I'll take that. Okay, we've got three more encounters before this incubator's over. I'm in scent. The way it's been going, though, I, I don't think we're going to get a Titanoboa. I mean, even trying to fish for any specific dinosaur is, unless it's like a Majungasaurus or like a common... Yeah, probably not gonna happen. Ooh, thank you for your patience. What are you gonna give us? Books? Ooh, 100 buggeroos. That's good. That's two, four, six uh, boosts. A, a Demetrodon done too. Okay, I'm just gonna fight this and get this incubator and at least have some good reward. And the final big hit on the Elicosaurus. Ooh, he got a bib. He got a bib on his... Oh my God, every hit I did there. I don't think I showed you the whole battle, but every single hit was a crit. <laughs> Why can't that happen when I'm doing the live matches? I tell you, because this game's secretly rigged. Right, that Demetrodon's about to go. So, yeah, that's not too bad. Uh, I guess they're pretty awful. Ooh, Saurus, and yeah, they're okay. I'll take those. Okay, we've got 10 seconds. Let's just quickly get some extra darts. Ooh, another interaction. Oh, I didn't realize... Can you get interactions with these? I didn't even realize you could. Oh, a scent. I like a good old scent, me. Ah, oh, Majoka, the worst. Oh, the worst. Go away. There you go. Have my giraffe a titan. Please, just give me, like, a titanoboa. Does it slightly show? Or am I completely see-through? My body's gone. There's a final countdown. Oh, it's like New Year's Eve. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six... Five, he's gonna disappear. Four, three, and two, he'll go. Two, one. Whoa, I thought, I thought that might have been it there, actually. <laughs> you gotta admit, that looked like it could have been a Titanoboa shape. Ah, oh, Spinosaurus Gen 2, you waste of space. I think you might have a hybrid now, though. But you know what? I'll dart you. What were the chances? There might have been 0% chance of us getting a Titanoboa there. But, oh god, oh jeez, oh no, oh no, it's a good job I don't really want you. Ah, close, 179. Oh, that's bad. I could have got like 80 odd extra there. But you know what, I don't really care about it, so no loss. You know what we will do before we go, however? People have asked me to try the um, this again, these battles. There's a lot on, up, up for grabs. There's 20 Magnetator, 20 Trichosaurus, 20 Utaranex, and 20 of that thing. And I don't even know what that is again. Um, 
Is there anything in particular I could go for? Magnetator is pretty decent. Trichosaurus against Magnetator. And I think the Smilodon has like a precise rampage, which means it's basically because you no matter what you've got. But we'll try that. We'll try this team. I think this one's the hardest. I, I think the last battle's not too bad, but this one is tough. So come on. I do have my boosts for this, but they also have... Oh, no. Yep, couldn't have got much worse. I mean, I may as well. I may as well just go for a big hit. Oh, I got a crit. That's not too bad. Oh, but he got a crit as well. Um, ooh, ew, just survive. Just survive. Okay, so what are the chances he goes for invincibility? Even if he does, I'm going to go first do my cloak. So there's nothing I can really do. I might as well just go for a switch. I'm going to die either way. So I might as well do damage and get out of there. Now, my... I only need three kills. The problem is he's got four dinosaurs, as like me. Um, now, I think I can do this. Now, I want to put more attack on this because it's already got 2,072 attack. Um, is 600 off? <gasps> It was close. Okay, this is good. I'm super quick. And I also have my big hit. Ooh, the tiger. Mmm. Mm, the armored tiger. Right. So, what? Could, he's not going to go first. And he can't really do anything. He can do 3,200 damage. But I can do this. Oh, I may as well. I may as well. This is the armor. The armor is crazy on this thing. Defense. Ooh, okay. Okay, shielded decelerating strike, but I've got immunity. I am now... Oh, I shouldn't have. I shouldn't have. Oh, no. He's going to go for precise rampage, isn't he? Oh, no, he didn't. Oh, okay. It's not bad, though. It's not bad. Is he immune to... Uh, oh, he's, uh, he's not immune. Oh, this is good. We can go for this one. We can go for this. Here we go. Here we go. We'll lower his attack. What does he go for? Ha, ha, ha. Did nothing. Yes. That's good. And we keep our uh, evasion. So he switches to Magnetate. Now, Magnetate. Oh, it's not faster than me. Get in. Okay, we'll do a big hit here. We'll do a big hit here. He's probably going to kill me, though. 4,144. And he... Oh, wait, what? No! Oh, did we have evasion on there? Oh, no. Okay, he's got almost a 4,000 hit. Ah, oh, this isn't good, though. Because he's going to go for it. Damn. Damn. Okay. We're just going to have to go for ours. Oh, wait. We're quicker. Oh. Guys. Guys, you might be with a chance. Swap and stun. Well, we're immune. So that's good. Are we going to do it? No. Don't say. He's got, he's got something else, right? Something that's crazy. And now we've got an armor piercing. Now we've got an armor piercing. There's nothing you can do. We've got him. And then what's next? He's got a trichosaurus, right? He's got a trike, and he's got... I don't know, we killed it. We killed the trike. Oh, God, what's next? Oh, you Tauranex. Oh, no. Okay. Um... Oh, this is tricky. Ooh. Because he's going to go for distracting impact, isn't he? Oh, no. If I didn't, if I didn't use that, if I used the other way around, I could have done this. Wait, what? Wait, what's his attack? It's one... Oh, no. It's one extra. My health, 2118. His attack, 2119. If he goes for instant charge, he's killed me. I don't think he'll do it. Do I risk it? Do I risk the biscuit at this point? Or do I go for try? Because even if he does that... I'm stunned. And then he goes for his rampage and proper kills me. So either way, my trike is probably dying. Or not. You know what? Sod it. Okay. We're going to have to do this. We're going to have to do this. Did he go for it? Oh, he did. Oh, he did. Don't get stunned. Oh, he got a crit. Don't get stunned. Ah, oh, you bugger you. He's going to go for rampage run now, right? Distracting impact. Oh, it's a big hit. Right, but I've got my big hit, right? I got my big hit ready. If he goes for Rampage and Run, I'm dead. 
If he goes to Rampage Run, I'm dead. I have to. I have to do this. I have to go for it. Because he'll probably do his Rampage and Run. Yeah, I thought so. Right, at least we do damage to him. Oh, the only problem is Magnetator's come in and... Oh, we were so close! We were so close! Oh! Watch his attack. Oh, hold on, hold on. He might go for regular hit here. He might go for regular hit. If he does, we've killed him. No! Oh, you buggy, you dumb! Oh, no, but just did it the other way around. If I just hadn't gone for the distracting impact and went for the nullifying first, I could have had him. I could have had him. Oh, okay, well, there's next time. Next time we'll do it. We'll do that and we'll do it better because that camera is about to die any second. But if you enjoyed this video, good luck searching for Titanoboa and its said hybrids. And until next time, I'll see you later. Oh, bye-bye.